What do you want? Oh, fuck it. I said a thousand times that I don't want any junkies at my door. If you want to score, man, you gotta fucking call first. Come on. Beat it. For what? I said get out of here. You're gonna cause me trouble, and I don't like trouble. Hey, take it easy, man. Huh? Keep cool. <laughs> what do you want? Dope? Money? Tell me what you need. Sure, we can make a deal. Huh? God, I'm gonna blow your brains out, you son of a bitch! You think you can come into my house and steal my dog? You're gonna be shooting up in hell, oh, motherfucker! Oh, oh, man. Will you stop fucking moving? No way to hide, junkie asshole! I can Hold it, man. I give you whatever you want. Got dope? I got cash? You you want some dope? Please, please don't kill me, man. I got children. These my girls, see? This one's Sarah, and a little one, that's Cindy. Please, man, I wanna see them again. Please, please don't shoot. I'm a father too, but I have no choice. I got your information. 
And the owner of the apartment in Marble Street is a Dr. Adrian Baker. He's a struck-off surgeon. They used to sell drugs to junkies on the quad. He made some cash and bought up some cheap-ass apartments, including the one in Marble Street. Of course, he got caught. He did a few months in prison and was struck off the medical register. Interesting. Thanks for the information, Sam. I owe you one. Hey, Matt, be careful, okay? I'm on it. Talk to you later. The owner of the apartment where Ethan cut off his finger lives here. It's not much of a lead, but it's all I've got. I'm going to act all doped up. I hope he goes for the bait. Gotta find some way to get him to talk about the Marble Street apartment. Hi. Uh, I was told that you could get the Tropin without a prescription. Sorry, you were misinformed. Goodbye. Uh, hold on. I, I, I really need your help here. I can pay. Well, why didn't you say so? Please, come in. So, you're looking for betropin, my dear. Are you having trouble sleeping? How much do you need? I don't know, um, about three, four boxes. Well, no, that shouldn't be a problem. Would you like a drink? I was just about to have one. Sure, why not? I haven't seen you around here before. Who told you about me? I can't remember. My brain's fried with all these pills. Can't tell Dave from night half the time. Do you have many clients? A few. I help to ease their anxiety. Get my hands been off, thin enough, hard working enough. I reassure those who find the system too difficult. I'm like a safety valve that keeps society from imploding. I heard you had some apartments for rent. I'm looking. Sorry, darling. Those are all booked up. Shame. I was looking for something around Marble Street. You're not drinking? Yeah, sure I am. Having some trouble? Didn't your mother ever warn you about accepting gifts from strangers? <laughs> to Matthew. He claimed he had come to the census. Another one of those goddamn government spies. 
So, you're interested in my Marble Street apartment. I rent it to my friend Paco, you must know. I have no idea what he does there. Maybe that's where he fornicates with his dancers from the Blue Lagoon. <laughs> to be honest, I don't give a damn, so as long as he pays his rent, he can do whatever he likes. But enough with the chit chat. I miss surgery, you see, so I take every opportunity to practice. I don't have any instruments here, so I use whatever comes to hand. I hope you won't hold that against me. Hold tight. This might sting him. Have you ever noticed, as soon as you start to do a little housework, someone always comes calling? I'll get rid of our visitor and be right back. Don't move. I won't be long. Word of the Lord in the form of this magnificent Bible, which I will gladly leave with you in return for a contribution of only five dollars. No thanks, I'm not interested. Come, Albert. I cannot believe the word of the Lord is of no interest to you. We, his humble flock, should walk in his steps for St. John has said. Thanks a lot, but I don't need any. He does not need a Bible in these times of violence and hatred. Holy Scripture will bring you peace and tranquility. Oh! <gasps> 